We're here up at the Middlesex Academy in Finchley. I'm joined by Andy Mitchell, Middlesex's strength and conditioning coach. So you've had the boys now for, what, four weeks back from uh, back uh, in winter training? Yeah. No, about, well, yeah, 17 days. We came okay. back at the start of the year, start of the month. And how are they progressing? Good. I mean, they always, uh, we always encourage them to, to take some proper time off during October. Obviously, the cricket season's long and it's hard, uh, especially this year. They were playing probably five or six days out of seven most of the year. Um, so it's important that they have their downtime, but equally, they get four weeks off and, and now it's time to switch back on and start thinking about the, uh, the new season ahead. So, uh, so yeah, it's always an exciting time for me because this is where I can you know, sort of really get my teeth, uh, my teeth stuck into some good work and, and equally uh, I like to think that they, they enjoy it. Uh, they're a competitive bunch so you start pitting them against each other and, and, and putting challenges up and goals and they'll, they'll go for it so, so it's really good. Uh, Andy, we've just been uh, through one of your sessions. Uh, I took part myself at the end. I'm absolutely exhausted now. Uh, how was it, buddy? What did you uh, What did you get up to? Yeah, good. Um, always nice to have the lads back in training. They've, uh, we've got a really good group this year, so uh, uh, so they've been working hard today. We've had them. So first things first, we always do. We check their recovery, uh, make sure we're looking after them. So obviously we're pushing them hard, but uh, equally not pushing them too hard to the point of overtraining. Uh, they did some speed work this morning. Uh, so a lot of mechanics drills. Uh, trying to get them moving faster and more efficiently uh, and then we did some lower body strength work some sort of prehab and injury prevention work and then we finished off with uh, a bit of a conditioning session at the end which you uh, 
I don't know if you can say you took full part in, but you you certainly had a bash at the end. Well, I, I figured it was unfair filming the boys and then not at least mate, uh, having quite, a little go. Quite, I completely agree. You can't start laughing at them until you've done it. Well, mate, I'll be back in about a month to see how the boys Excellent. are coming along. I've experienced, I think, about 10% of what they've done today, and I'm absolutely shattered, so I know you're putting the boys through their paces. Yeah, they work hard. So well done, mate. Keep it up. No worries. Thanks.